then should be right here. Yeah. There we go. Now I've got at least got a shortcut loop. So let's continue on the high road then. Okay, pitch is starting to sing. And there is a treasure on the plateau guarded by the Toad Sage. Okay. Gotta get ready for Toad Fight. Ooh! Okay, I actually... I actually saw his attack charging that time. So, like, yeah, the Toad Sage seems like he does, like, a poisonous burst thing. Although that would look like a different spell. I think he was doing something else. Like, I saw eyes, and now I see yellow. Okay, so... That's his thing. He charges up spells of different effects. They start to spawn on me, and then they explode after sitting for a minute. I've learned the secrets of your toad magic, Toad Sage. You cannot fool me forever. Hmm. Well, I can't get that box right now because that ladder is uh, doubled up. But I did see that rock, and it seems to have led to further exploration down below. How are we looking? I'm still missing the treasure fragment, the map fragment for this place, rather. Hmm. Yeah, let's keep going. So... Now we go down into the caves. Oh, 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 slime. Okay, those are just little slime holes, not, not accessible for, for human warriors. And looks like this is also the gecko's home caves. I mean, this entire place is their home, clearly. Geckos and frogs alike. And Pitch does not know what to do with himself. There's probably is a legitimate treasure in here somewhere. Oh, I spy a pool. Okay, well, I ain't gonna mess with that just yet. Mainly because I need to make sure I know where I'm going with it. That's a chroma. What's a chroma doing here? All right, so I'm going to assume that that spot there with the torch with nothing else in it, that's probably where I want to pool slime my way to. So let's go. Alternatively, I could also go up all the way and see if I can uh, go into those little slime holes. That's probably not it, though. This, on the other hand... Let's see. We've got ourselves a little slime maze complete with... Foliage Obscurities. Yeah. Okay, so just... Just keep hugging a wall, and I'll get through it eventually. Ooh, and there's some treasure in here. It's actually not that hard to get to, in fact. And it's a regen vial. Uh, okay. Okay. Well, I could use one. Oh, I want to go this way. A shame I can't use regen vials and potions and stuff like that while I'm a slime. But I can do that, and then go back and get my treasure. <laughs> so, let's do that. Okay, yep, it's up this way. And then looks like we're getting up to some more geckos and toad sages. Uh-oh. I actually do wonder how much more there is to this swamp. Because I feel like I'm going at a pretty good pace here. Okay, fire. Miss with my explosions, but then kill the toad. That's not a toad, that's a gecko. Do I not understand my amphibians? Hmm. I think I see something else I can do, but before I interact with it, I've got a Toad Sage to murder. Ah, you sneaky little... Die! Alright. 
But yeah, I think there might be another slime opening over here. There was. But it's not quite what I expected, which means that it wants me to go here as the slime. But why? Why does it want me to go here as slime? To do this. But then why here? To go over to the Toad Sage's bath pond? It would seem so. But to what end does this lead? I'm just going further and further beyond as the slime right now. Okay, I think, first of all, I gotta deal with these bugs. And I think that the, I, I discovered a secret that I can't fi finalize yet. I'm pretty sure I need to get through this door as the slime. So let's, yeah, cause there's like a slime hole there. And another entrance here. So yeah, that's just gonna continue. Hmm. All right, before I go back down for that. Okay, that's a ladder. But there's more slime holes, so I could theoretically end up going even higher. Hmm. Let's deal with the enemies over here, and then I'll go back and try it. And see what all I get to do with slime power. All right, Toad Man, where'd you go? Not over there. Which bath are you bathing in? All right, come on, jump, 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 jump. Screw it. Found him. What the heck, did he just croak at me? Oh! I was swarmed with bugs. Uh... I'm not quite sure what I could have done there. I mean, I was trying to get to my healing potion, but... Obviously, that didn't pan out. Let me get to that in advance. Okay. We're just gonna stick to win mode. And stick to the high ground. Hello. A blood ring plus plus. I, I didn't mean to skip past it quite that fast, but I saw it. Blood ring plus plus. Yes, please. Oh. Go away. Oh, I didn't even realize the frogs have a wind-based attack. So even though they're weak to fire, being in wind is definitely the smarter play. Okay. Well, that's definitely the pond he was at before. So I don't know where he went. Must be over here. Yep. Hello. Got him. Good lord. Also, not quite sure how I can get up there. I'll worry about that in a minute. First things first, I want to take care of the slime thing before I forget. Oh, right, because I died, everything I killed respawned. Ugh. Well, at least it was just a couple of geckos and some mosquito bugs. Oh, right, and another toad sage. <sighs> Doggone it. Okay, and I can't defend myself against his magic either. I didn't even notice my health. <sighs> I'm gonna just do all that again real quick. Don't mind me. Ay, ay, ay. All right. The path, as far as I can tell now, is clear. I didn't see those slimes, but you know what? I don't care. Whew. So. We now go up our slimy stairway. And we can now get this treasure and then progress through the rest of whatever this is. Magic Amulet plus plus, not too bad. 
Um. Okay, there's something I'm not seeing then. Hmm. Let me look at the map real quick. <laughs> Taking moments before disaster. I guess that there... I guess that's all there was to it then. I, I could have sworn I was going to end up having to go all the way up this shaft, but... I guess it was just for that one treasure. Like, this right here looks like somewhere else I should go as a slime. But there's no way I can get up there. Weird. Okay, well, um... I have no idea how to get to that treasure. This is the unfortunate part. Like, the one up here. So on this side, it's blocked by that ladder being a double ladder. And on the other side, I don't remember. I just remember it was blocked by a th something. <sighs> so if I go back around, how did I get up there in the first place? Was it just by taking the high path from the beginning? Ah, uh, man. Sorry about that. Uh. For the first time ever, I have had gotten myself an error that was telling me I didn't have enough space to continue my recording. So, that's fun. Not entirely sure when it cut off, but it sure cut off. Anyways, I'm going to continue on now. Um, I, so yeah, it's a doubled up ladder on both sides, which now begs the question of how do I get up there in the first place to undouble the ladder. Right now, the only thing I can think of that makes any sense is the hydro bubble I can see on the map. So I'm gonna head over this way and try for that. Nope. Darn it. Dang. Frogs and mosquitoes everywhere. for it. Okay, no. For some reason, I thought that one of those frogs was going to come back down. I was going to hit him with my, uh, that. My, my after image. But he never came back down. I must have just hit him with one of my projectiles and didn't even realize it. <sighs> anyway. Okay, I was going to say, Pitch is also singing, but I also noticed that there's a platform up there with a crystal, so that's probably what the Hydra Bubble is for. And maybe the sand crystal will let me get to the treasure chest. Oh, jeez. Nope. Wrong way. There. 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 Oh, man. This is quite a thing. Oh, jeez. Nope. Not what I was expecting. Okay. We take the high road. And yes. All right. Oh, that's a lot of owls. That is, in fact, a large number of owls, and I am slightly disturbed. Why is this one's eyes not bright? That feels like it's something significant. It doesn't feel random. It feels... Like it might be important, and I don't know how I feel about that. Well, if it is something important, I have no idea what it could possibly begin to mean. Okay, so that had nothing to do with Pitch's sing song, and he's getting more sing song the more to the right I go. And down. Which tells me one of two things there's either a treasure hidden below me somewhere. Or Pitch has had his uh, inaugural for the swamp um, false positive. I'm putting my money on option B. So, I guess I'll just leave it at that and continue on. I'm not, I don't even know how many treasures I'm missing here at this point. Because I haven't got the treasure, uh, the, I keep saying treasure, the map fragment. Okay, I take back what I said about that one owl with the eyes that didn't go glow bright. It's clearly a glitch, as you can see with what's going on with that one. <laughs> Ooh. 
starting to make our way to a fortress of some kind now. I mean, that makes sense. We were trying to go to one, right? So, we're just now starting to reach the walls. Okay. So, I guess I want to push this block to the right. Go away, Gecko. And those geckos have been the cause of so much death already. They're adorable, but they are devastating. Also, a level up. Nice. Yeah, no, no. Wrong element. There we go. Okay. We're winded up again. Go away, geckos. I don't need to be stabbed by a lizard. Just keep pushing this block. I spy a hole in the wall and a slime pool. I'm not sure what the purpose of this block is. Unless I was supposed to push it to the left. I don't know, the block has one of two purposes and Oh wait, no. I know what its purpose is. It is to it's to go up there, because I can't make it otherwise. But what about the slime pool? What's its purpose? Could it be to go this way? Aha! Pitch was actually correct. There was treasure hidden. And there appears like there could be more? I don't know, that's the same spot he was singing earlier. Let me just take a look. See if this is the same. Yeah, this is the same. I don't know. I don't know if he's real or not at this point. I don't know what to believe. Back here. Let's get this block a little bit closer. Yeah, I needed the block to get up here. And what do you know? Treasure! <laughs> Ammo shards. Okay, that's cool. Uh, that's another frog shaman pool. This is gonna be a frog shaman up ahead, I assume. Yep, there he is. Hello, frog shaman. All right. How far back did you want to take your bath? Ah, all the way back. Okay, Pitch is singing. And it's because there's a treasure right here. Nice. Oh, oh, oh no, no, no. Dang it, okay. Don't fall in the poison. Just explode to destroy the mosquitoes. Looks like there's a uh, bumble wall there in the mist. But is there a fan? Probably up here, if I had to guess. Or maybe not. I don't know. I can't really do much in the mist without a fan. I mean, I can stand in it for a bit, but... Last thing I need is to die by poison mist whilst being sliced by geckos. That is not conducive to my survival. At least that treasure doesn't require any, uh, mist shenanigans. Ah, hello! Okay! Got ourselves another little, uh, amphibian outpost. Oh, boy. Let's heal before I die. Uh, right. I want to switch to wind. Anything up here? Oh, hold up. There might be something up here. Oh, wrong thing. This. Yo! Haha! -ha! Sticky bombs! Hello! I did not expect a robot. Honestly, I was expecting that to be a bigel. Oop. Okay. Oh, let's. I don't know where you're going, Robo. 
uncork half and make it safe to traverse. Oh, there's a door. Is he going to open the door? He did. How thoughtful. Oh, well, let's deal with this first. I mean, sand, man. Open box. Acquire Lacrima. Okay, well, we know there's at least three more Lacrima fragments in the game. Wouldn't be surprised if there's more, though. We are 87% complete with the swamp. I'm really wondering if, like, we're going to find the map fragment and it's going to tell me, Hey, you've now found all the treasure. At this point, I wouldn't, su I wouldn't be surprised. There we go. All right. But now, let us go down. I was kind of right when I said that I thought that path would lead to a Beigle. It just did so indirectly. Speaking of Beigle, we're only missing two, and one of them is in the Tempest Plains. So, is this going to be where the last Beigle is, or will there be one in, like, the next area? Because I'm sure there's another area after this. Scribbles! We haven't seen you in a while. Are you how I get my map? You get lost just because you want to. I'll never confuse your armor with another tin man, yes? Don't worry, I always keep several copies of all my maps. I shall keep them until you decide you're interested. I'm interested. Buy the swamp map. You know this continent as I do now. There's nothing else I can help you with. If you thought I was going to spend the rest of my days in the city, you were quite wrong. I'm thinking about traveling in other lands with my caravan. If you ever pass by, I'll have a good pile of maps for you, yes? I don't doubt it. I am missing one Beigle and one treasure. And that's it. I feel like I have been quite thorough. But there are definitely a couple of spots I can see some gaps I might be able to fill. And looking at the map itself, I haven't missed anything that Scribbles hasn't, uh, didn't have covered, so, yeah. I'm missing one Beigle and four boxes here, and one Beigle and one box here. But, hmm, yeah. I've been going for long enough, and I'm going to stop it here. In fact, I'm looking at my time here, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to be splitting this in a two. But either way, next time on Soldiers, I'm going to find the rest of that missing stuff in both areas and then move on towards this uh, light beyond Scribbles. I'm not sure what to expect, but considering there's, no, there's no more Beigle past here, I have a feeling we're definitely nearing the end. Until then, thanks so much for watching. Goodbye.